Hello guys, what you can see on my back is the water ingress control panel. From here, I'm going to show you how to test the water ingress system on a bulk carrier ship. As you can find here, the water ingress system is made by Seamate Incorporated, made it by Hiroshima Japan. From here, you will find the light for the upper portion sensor known as the main alarm and the lower portion as the pre-alarm also included the water detector on four peak tank here from here you will find also the override button as you press it the alarm will come what you need to do is to buzzer stop once you push a buzzer stop this will continue flickering and once you press the override this flickering light will be gone same also on the number 4 since now the number 4 hold have water the main alarm is activated if you want to remove this light you just need to press the override button for the cargo hold number 4. You will find while the override button is lighted up, any light indicators for the water detection known as the water ingress is being deactivated. By the way, this water ingress alarm panel have a special switch inside and take note when you do uh, testing for the water and gas alarm you must need to put the switch on a test mode so that any delay on the alarm will be avoided from here you can find there is a switch this is for normal and this is for testing and as you observe once we test the sensor with a fresh water it takes long time before producing alarm so we try to put the water with salt and you will see if the alarm will be easily be activated on the cargo hold number two this is number two the pre-alarm and the main alarm this is my cargo hold number two i'm going down to check the water ingress system inside hey friend what are you doing there i'm uh, taking out the water of the uh, waste space and entrance of the cargo hold because so many water my friend Oh, uh, for also, that, you are so very, very hard-working person. Uh, I'm very sweet, huh? Yes. Because <laughs> I hope that uh, you do a lot of job so that you earn a lot of money, <laughs> your family become happy. Okay. Okay, guys. Okay. That is what we are doing here on deck now. Both AB electrician OS everybody is busy so I am here on the entrance of our cargo hold I'm going down to check the actual condition of our water ingress sensor I am going down to check the water ingress sensor so that we will know the actual condition of the water ingress so the bank ship there is two ways to go inside of the cargo hold using a uh, spiral ladder and the straight ladder. On the other side, you will find the straight ladder. But here I'm using the spiral ladder, the easiest way to go down inside of the cargo holds. This is the spiral ladder and we are going down and on the other side there is a 
straight tracker. My friend now is doing some maintenance job inside of the cargo hold and I will go down to check the actual condition of our water ingress sensors. This is our cargo hold. This is a bulk carrier. From top to bottom around 24 meters. 24 meters high. This bulk carrier is a hold where you can put the grains, the canola oil, the corn, even rice can. This uh, bulk carrier is navigating from Pakistan to Brazil, Brazil to Suez Canal, going to Ukraine. Also, this ship before comes from Canada, Australia, Vietnam. This ship is operating worldwide. What you see here is the inside structure of the cargo hold for a bulk carrier ship and down you will find a lot of uh, void space copper and from the side you will find the water ingress sensors one on the high and one for the pre alarm guys what you see here is the lower portion of my water ingress and on top is the upper portion of my water ingress I'm going to put a sea water or fresh water on it once you put a fresh water or sea water on it this water ingress sensor will activate the alarm located on the ship's office and on the wheelhouse bridge Okay now guys, I'm just calling the bridge to test the water ingress system Oh, don't tell me yung kudat niya lik Pasok, bridge Pasok lag Sin ko to ha Sige, Rod Help us Bridge, pass of bridge. Good. Nag-alarm na dyan? Wala pa. Ah, okay, okay. Sige. Stand by na lang. I'm going to test this high-level high water ingress using a salt water. It's a sea water. Tech, nag-alarm na tech. As confirmed on the bridge, alarm is coming. Guys, as confirmed, the water ingress is activated using a sea water. Pasok third. Okay, na pakinisit na dyan yung water ingress system. Hindi ko na picture yung ano, yung spray at sa amin. Isa pa, isa pa, isa pa. Lagyan ko ulit ng sea water. Now I'm going to repeat and put another sea water so that the third officer will make a photos on bridge. Okay, sea water already put on the high level alarm. May alarm na. Okay, thank you. Instead, the water ingress sensor alarm on cargo hold number 2, 1, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. Now, we are closing the hatch cover of our cargo holds. Bye. 
Better, better lah. Kali ni mau ayat ulik no. Semangat, bawa. As you can find down there is this is a cargo hold from which you can find the upper and lower water ingress sensor. As you can find this is the upper and on the bottom is the lower part. The lower part is the pre-alarm sensor and the upper part is the high water level alarm sensor for water ingress this is about carrier ship and we are just cleaning it while cleaning the cargo hold we are also testing the water ingress system This is my friend, Arden. This is my friend, Deloitte, Abu Sayyaf. Pre-alarm, main alarm, lower part, upper part. Ayo, di na picturean, picturean tu. Ayat. Yang apa pak kamu yang setas? Takalan jelah, takalan di, alon jelah. Pre-alarm, main alarm dah yang saya bawa, bawa bos aja lah. Yang taas, ya. Cepat set. Okay, number two. 
Oke. Oke, 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 for the water ingress I put this back into a normal okay and you will find the water ingress system have a lot of PCB electronics also here have the, the fuses here has a power supply this power supply have an output of 24 volts DC also it has a plc known as programmable logic controller this programmable logic controller has a plc1 fx 2 and 16 y eyr and extension module from here you will find input lights and output lights you find here there is number four number four light meaning there is alarm on the number four okay this is my water ingress system sensor type DPS2 made by Yamamoto Electric Industrial Limited from Japan. This is my water ingress alarm system barrier relay box. Okay, guys, that's it. I hope that you learn a knowledge on how to test a water ingress alarm inside of the cargo holds this is a bulk ship thank you